Hi friends, in this video I'll teach you how to create your first project using Arduino. So you need an Arduino board, one LED and the cable. So first of all go to Google and uh, download Arduino software. So go to the official website and you need to scroll a bit to find uh, the version for Windows or Linux. So once you download and install, you will see a uh, application like this. So you will see some code already written over there. So let us first create a variable named as LED and we define uh, its value as 13. Now go to set a part and define on which pin you are going to have your output. So pin mode 13 comma output. Make sure you have a uh, output written in capitals and a semicolon after it. So whatever you want to repeat you need to put in a method named as loop. So we will pass on instructions to turn on LED and then wait for one second and then turn off and then wait for one second. So the instruction to turn on the LED is digital write and in bracket you need to give that on which pin. So we are using the variable LED. In fact you can also write the pin number directly. Comma high to turn it on and comma high, uh, low to turn it off. And in between we are adding delay of 1000 milliseconds or one second. So after doing this you verify your code first of all it should compile successfully if you do not make any issues. And then it is time to upload it on the board but before that make sure that you have connected the, your Arduino uh, with your laptop. So you check whether you have configured your right Arduino. Once you connect you also check whether you have selected uh, the right uh, com, uh, com settings here. So now coming to the LED. LED has two pins or hands one is the bigger one one is smaller Sm uh, smaller one is negative uh, anode and the bigger one is cathode which is positive so the bigger one you need to insert in pin uh, 13 of uh, Arduino and uh, the, the smaller one you need to put in ground one so that is all what you need because you are just going to uh, blink your LED that's all now you need to connect your USB cable with your laptop as well as the Arduino. So once you do this, now uh, you also check your board information. If you are getting your board information correctly, that means your board is connected. So it is time to upload your code on the board. So once we do this, you will soon start seeing your operation happening. So the LED is blinking. That's all about your project. So stay connected with Extreme Automation and we will be uh, uploading more such uh, tutorials on Arduino, some command line interfaces and a lot more things about automation. Stay connected. Have a nice